This is all the way messed up. <clears throat> What's up, chat? Give me one second. Let me get this sorted out. DJ, how you feeling? We got Mookie, we got Papa Beans, T.O. Money, Zeus, what's good? Amp DC, what's good? Cut that down a little bit more. There we go. What's good, Robert Huff? How everybody feeling tonight? Said we just back again playing some more Jane, um, talking rumors, stuff like that. I'm just hanging out for a bit. Um, what else do I need to do for Jane? What's the word, Dorian? You tell me. <coughs> What's good, Mr. Clean Kids? good on audio and everything everybody can hear everything and see everything just making sure we getting off to a solid start um, got to do some halves okay Zeus, you taking a break? You've been playing Jane for almost two days in a row. <clears throat> hey, that'll do it to you. What's up, Farm? Farms. How you been, bro? <laughs> What's good, Yard Drats? I forgot to make a link for you. I gotta, um, I'm still setting up Nightbot and everything. Um, I'll get everything sorted. I definitely gotta get you a link in there. Guys, um, check out Yard Drats Hearts. If you want to learn how to build, you know, he got one of the best Kates in the game and one of the best Widows I've seen. He can definitely point you in the right direction. What's up, OG Splinter? Um, um we can run, we can run um, together if you guys want to hop in. If anybody wants to hop in and run the hive real quick, we can do that. But, um, in fact, let me check something. Butt cheek Jane skin. Hey, that's it'll probably drop tomorrow. Probably hit the marketplace tomorrow. <coughs> yeah, um, yeah, DJ. Uh, I kind of just started going back to the vendors and everything. Speaking of, that's, that's actually something I could be doing now. I'm doing the rounds with the vendors. But yeah, the reason we got, um, War Machine and the thumbnail is because they just announced that his new show, um, Armor Wars, is going to begin sh filming this fall. So, his show is definitely going to drop in 2023. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking mid 2023, so maybe like sometime around April or June. I actually don't need any of this, anything from here. Avengers! Yo, who we got, who we got? All right. I apologize, give me one second, alert box fell down.
appreciate that subscriber unfortunately I didn't get a chance to see it because of uh, the alert box set up should be good now so anybody that subs now you you will get the proper alert and everything okay Oz you you subscribe appreciate that bro really appreciate that is Wolverine going to be a hero um right now he's not in the plans but you know as I said in my video today plans change you know you got the the MCU um, debut for the X-Men right around the corner so it's like you never know and again this game they do have to kind of adhere to Marvel overhead and oversight so if Marvel says they want them in this game <laughs> I can guarantee you they will appear in the game Yeah, Mr. Clean Kiss. Um, so, like I, I just said in my my other video, that it's looking like they are leaning towards changing the order. So where we thought we would be getting um, She-Hulk right after cloning Labs and Jane Foster, it's looking like they may pivot away from that. And I think the reason behind that would be they kind of want to put some distance in between um, she She-Hulk and Jane Foster. That way. You know, they already got a lot of negative press with Jane being a copy of Thor and everything. So, and there are some people who, who like to have to take that She-Hulk will just be a clone of Hulk, which obviously that's not going to be the case. But, you know, that is, you know, one of the narratives that's floating around. So, to avoid the, the narrative, to avoid the narrative of, hey, they're, they're putting out clones back to back. All right, you got you got Jane Foster, and then we drop Winter Soldier right behind her, and you know that would be someone who's viewed as more of an original character, you know, all around. Even though She-Hulk will be, you know, very unique from Hulk. You know, she's going to be faster. She's going to have, you know, wrestling attacks and stuff like that. She's going to be more finesse and more agile than Hulk. But you, you you know how the internet works, and once you know people get bad takes, they just stick to it. So. I think that's that could be some of the reasoning behind possibly seeing um, Winter Soldier up here ahead of She-Hulk. Put we'll put Nightbot on timeout for a minute. She <laughs> she getting confused. You good, um, TL money? I see that. You know they she called it spam, and you good, bro? Like I said, Nightbot is still new. I'm still getting everything set up with it, so you know bear with me. Um, I need an epic precision. All right, we'll see. Um, Woodrow, yeah, I, I like like I said, I would never complain about getting Winter Soldier in the game faster than what we expected. Um, check with Roy. Thirty percent is critical damage. Yeah, I'll take that. I will take that. Let me see. Got targeted buff, range, plasma, and we got defense. Uh, might come in. Might be able to use that for something later. So probably win a soldier, then she hulk. Yeah, that's that's something that could be on the table. That's that's one of the rumors going around. And like right now, it's, it's nothing concrete. You know, that's just something that's kind of floating around. So. Once it does seem, you know, a lot more tangible, I definitely let you guys know. But right now, it, it just seems like that's something that's possibly being considered. So I don't know how concrete that is. Um, Jane was way too similar for you. Um, 
Like I said, she she's literally supposed to be Thor. So it's like I understand people who were hoping for maybe a little more variety and create creativity with her, but she's really not that different from him in the comics. And it's like, yeah, they could have you know maybe tweaked some things with her heroics a little bit more, but you know for the most part, she you know she pretty much is what I expected her to be. Oh yeah, I got to show you guys some stuff. Um. With the with some of the heroes, they finally got the traversal bug fixed, thankfully. So, you know, no more flying Captain Americas and stuff like that. Um, Thor, he is an A pose and not the um, using his intrinsic anymore. So, it's, it looks like they came through with you know the fixes that they promised in this patch. And you know, like I said, I. I haven't seen any reports of anything major being broken or anything like that, but you know, if you guys have had problems, um let me know and I'll try to pass that along. Yeah, you good to your money, bro. Like like I said, it's it's new. <laughs> it's, it's still gotta work out the kinks with it and everything. Um if you guys are playing, you you wanna grab this piece out of the vendor right now. Like this is one of her best gear pieces right now. this one too that's a good one um i'm definitely liking her gear so far i will say that the buff. Mm, i'm all right all right let me catch up on chat um honestly for me all i need is one of soldier i agree like i said I, like i said i want everybody I'll take, you know, any hero they got in the pipeline, I'll take it because, you know, they, that's one of the things I feel like they shine the most in is hero development. So it's like I'm, I'm all for whoever they got. Um, How you think they would introduce Doctor Strange to the game if they were to add him? Um, well, like I said, if in my previous video, they are looking at the prequel novel, you know, for inspiration, I believe. And in, the, in that novel... Um, one of the threats that they were facing with Doctor Strange was from the, um, a group called the Zodiacs. And, you know, they, they were looking for an um, uh, ancient magic artifact called the Extinction Key. And with that, they, you know, they, you know typical, you know, supervillain stuff. They were going to take over the world and stuff like that. And, you know, um, you know just, just do stuff that particularly revolved around magic. Jalen, you're a new subscriber. Appreciate that, bro. Really appreciate that. I'm glad you guys are enjoying the videos. I'm glad you guys came through tonight. Um, you know, really appreciate the support as always. Um, but yeah, Doctor Strange, I feel like he, he they're teasing, you know, a magical threat with conversations with Zara Fari and um and Wakanda with um you know, it's just, you know, conversations with like um Star Scarlet Witch, Doctor Strange, um, even Loki, you know, so it's something they're, they're, you know, sowing the seeds for something and we just have to see how that plays out. But, um, they, ha they will obviously have to get past, um, Captain Marvel and the Kree invasion before they would, you know, feel like they were able to do that or, you know, bring him into the game. Uh, oh, mighty casual one. I, just want to say your participation and helping us make high ruler play got them nice it's appreciated uh strange going good rondo appreciate you coming through man and yeah i mean yeah, high ruler play it he he might not be like super excited for it but you know he if you guys want to he'll do it you know what i'm saying um i mean matter of fact speaking of high ruler let me test something There we go. So, you guys check out that link in the chat. In, um, in the chat, that's um straight to High Ruler. He, I think he's live now. He, um, I think he switched over to Fall Guys. One of my favorite streamers. You know, super cool. You know, super laid back, funny as hell. Like if you, you can go over there and throw anything at him, and, and you know he bounce it right back at you. Um, let's see. 
Devs mentioned 2.6 won't be in the same time frame as previous updates. You expect the next month will be dry? Um, pretty much. Um, I think next month, you know, they're they're gonna take advantage of you know the the Love and Thunder you know cross promotion, and we'll probably roll out a couple of skins and things like that. So Jane to get a skin, I'm pretty sure. Um, Thor is getting a new skin, obviously, and. They got the new um, in-game Iron Man um, skin coming. So, um, I, I think, yeah, next month might be pretty dry you know, outside of, like, skin content and things like that. Um, hopefully, they can squeeze in something. I know Brian was talking about, like, a smaller update, you know, just... You know, another like small fixes and things like that kind of update. So, you know, we'll see what they what they manage to do. And if we hear more news about when 2.6 will actually come and what's coming after that. Which I'm pretty sure once they really start talking about 2.6, they're going to announce the next hero that's coming in 2.7. So, um, that's pretty much where my expectations are. Um, they would need a more dangerous threat before adding stronger heroes. Um, they well, they got Ultron coming in the pipeline, so and that is a pretty credible threat. Um, does Jane have the same hammer throw that Thor does when you hold L two for a few seconds for the hammer to flash? Yeah. Um, so to get that, you have to go to the skill tree, and then you got to have mastery skills, I believe. What is it? I know it's in her skill tree. Um, I'll find it for you in one second. This is all this. Might be over here. Yeah, I think this is it. Yeah, so once you unlock Power of Uru, then you'll be able to do that. Um, I know Doctor Strange will be a strong character in the game. I, um, just think about the abilities he and Wanda will have. Yeah, they and like I said, the developers know that they they know you guys want to, and they also you know are intrigued about you know how how far they can go with combat and just new abilities with those kind of heroes. So it's like. Believe me when I tell you, those those two are definitely going to be in the pipeline at some point. They just have to get out the content that they've had lined up for the past two years. So you got Bucky, you got She-Hulk, you got Captain Marvel. Whoa. The Fat Jedi, what's good? Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you. Appreciate that sub. Appreciate that sub. What's going on? What I miss, and good to see you casual like you is. Calvin Coopy, bro, appreciate you coming through, and you haven't missed much. Um, just talking some of the stuff that um you know could be in the pipeline for Avengers, like War Machine, since um they announced Armor Wars will start filming this fall, so that sets it up for a 2023 2023 release date, and um just Bucky possibly coming ahead of She Hulk, um. Cloning labs possibly, you know, giving us a bit of a delay or a drought in July because it's obviously not coming next month. And, um, and Ultron being the next villain. Slide up. I'm hoping for Thor this tomorrow. Bro, if, if it comes, I'll, I'll definitely buy it. I'll definitely be picking it up. And Ultron will be a crazy boss fight like they've. We we've been hearing a lot about Ultron and how like some of his mechanics are set up. Like um, you ha you have they'll have to run around and I forgot what it is. I think it's like beacons or something like that. To you know, I think you'll have a, like a force field or something around him that you'll have to disable by grabbing beacons or something like that. Uh, what about War Machine? Like I said, War Machine he 
he was already in early development and I think he was halted because you know they were given the word that the Disney Plus show was kind of in the air at the time so instead of focusing on that they decided to focus on heroes you know who had pro projects that were already greenlit and started like She-Hulk and um you know the Winter Soldier and Captain Marvel what's good Cap Tay um Champagne Poppy was good. Do I listen to Dirk? Yeah, I listen to Dirk, bro. You got anything in specific? Or you know, what what kind of what kind of Dirk you you leaning towards? Winter Soldier will be my main. I'm just hoping they give him the most badass move set or I'll be disappointed. Um from what I'm hearing, his his move set is gonna be pretty decent. Uh he, he he's gonna have some pretty interesting gun mechanics. Um him having a sniper rifle a sniper rifle seems to still be on the table so it's like they they that's what i'm saying like i trust that's where i trust them the most is with combat it's like they they know what they're doing they have a a good you know feel for what what it takes to you know make heroes unique and fun in this game and you know they pull a ton of you know inspiration from you know different shows and movies and things like that so uh oh. JTB boy, what up? Appreciate you subbing, bro. Appreciate that. Thanks. Thank you for becoming an Avenger. Uh, how to upgrade past 150? So to get past 150, you can do one of two things. So you can do events and get exotic gear that drops at a higher level than 140, or you can do the raid and the OLT mission, so the Omega Level Threat mission. You do both of those, you'll get gear that's higher than level 140, or you do the events every two weeks and get gear that drops higher than level 140. Goo banging. Appreciate that, bro. Appreciate you coming through. Appreciate everybody. I see we got up to 100 in the chat. Um, If you guys can slap that like button, that'll definitely help the channel. You know, helps YouTube, you know, get some recognition, get some eyes on the channel. Always appreciate it. <clears throat> just trying to catch up on chat. You just hope they add Odin as a boss fight. Yeah, that would. Like I said, bro, I, I didn't even know I wanted that until I saw him in that trailer. And I'm like, that that would be dope. And that would legit be dope. Um, what else? What else? I don't even think we need Doctor Strange for Ultron. It would need to be a bigger threat. Um. Like I said, it's, it's bigger threats they can, you know, they can definitely pull from. And like I say, you never know. And, you know, right now the goal and the focus is to get out smaller content more often. So, you know, that means just playable villains, you know, different, different content that you want to play over and over again. Different heroes and things like that, you know, coming more, more often than having like, three to six month gap times in between and stuff like that. I, I think they really want to get away from that because they know that doesn't make them look good and, it's, you know, it doesn't, you know, keep the game in the best light. So they're aware of it. You know, they, they, they have self-awareness about the game and what it is and where it is. Uh, it would be cool if Ultron came with a horror mode. I, bro, I, I've been pushing that for the longest and I really hope they, they listen and take advantage of that. But, you know, like I said, it's, it's all about figuring out what works and, and what works the best and, you know, how to best implement it. So it's like you, it's, it's, a, it's an ongoing battle between, you know, what players want, want, what developers want, and what they're able to do in, in the time that they're given with the resources that they have. Uh, keep up the great work, bro. Appreciate that, Dragon Heart. Appreciate that. Appreciate you coming through. Um, think we'll get Vision with Ultron? No, I don't think we'll get Vision with Ultron. Ultron is more than likely going to come um, with She-Hulk as her villain. Um, but I do believe Vision will, you know, be teased or introduced in, you know, an, um, possibly the return of Ultron. So they may tease a return, or they may just tease um, Vision coming in the future, like Ultron saying he's, you know, working on a perfect body or something like that. Because, you know, he's always been the creator of Vision. Um, the Thor to skin, either going to be a hero starter bundle or a free PlayStation Plus skin, saying they deal with every hero. Um, possibly. 
Like I said, I, I won't complain about getting getting it free. I'll take it. Uh, over the next couple of years, how many characters do you think this game will have? I, I try not to even look that far ahead because it's like we we got so much we can be doing better right now. So if we can get up to a consistent three to four heroes every year, that'll be a, a strong, you know, I think that's that's the best we can hope for for right now. Um, because James scan was yesterday. I mean, reset is tomorrow, so like I said, we never know. And they didn't announce a skin just yet, so I think you know either we we don't get anything tomorrow or we we could get another skin for her. Yeah, you, know, you never know. When the soldier needs to come with an AR, absolutely. His his AR is an M4, and that's. <laughs> Back when I used to play Call of Duty, that was one of my favorite guns. So it's like, he definitely needs to have his M4. Um, Nightmare would be cool. Yeah, Nightmare Nightmare would be an awesome boss. And I, I think that's something they're, you know, they're considering. Just, you know, bosses that would be fun, but also, you know, feasible, you know, to have out in, in certain time frames. You didn't know this was still alive, yes, sir. Thor Bifrost need vibranium. Um, I, I I think I've heard about them considering you know exploring um adding um you know status effect to different uh, heroics and things like that. I think the conversation was mainly centered around Kate's heroics, but like I say you you know we just gotta wait and see how everything plays out. Any She-Hulk rumors? Um, only that she may come after Winter Soldier instead of the other way around that we originally thought. Tease Vision as an unplayable character like Hank Pym? No, 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 no. If they tease Vision, you know, it'll it'll be similar to um, you know, just every other hero like you know, like they tease Ant Man. You know, they they tease that Hank Pym, um, that not Hank Pym, Scott Lang is in the game. You just don't, you know, we. We haven't seen him introduced just yet, but they've you know opened the door for him to be introduced whenever they you know choose to or if they choose to or however they want to handle it. I got a theory that Nick Fury is actually a scroll. Um, just doesn't make sense how he got out of the time bubble. That's that's an interesting theory, and you know, I I would be all for that. You know, get the scroll right after the Kree. That would be cool. Or, you know, just, you know, slowly implement them. You know, have people realize, you know, they've been infiltrated. Maybe she likes Thor, but I have fun with her. Any She-Hulk or Winter Soldier rumors? Um, yeah, they, like I said, they, the only rumors for She-Hulk and um, Bucky right now are that they both are still coming and... The order may have changed, so you might get Winter Soldier ahead of um, She-Hulk, but that's still, you know, just rumors at this point. Like I said, at best, I think it's just something they're considering as a possibility. I'm totally open to some copy, copy heroes also, because they did so well with Jane. Yeah, like. Like I said, I'm I'm all for you know smaller releases and heroes and stuff like that. I um I don't think they should get too crazy with you know people who don't really have that much variety between the two. So like more Hawkeyes and Cates and less you know Thors and Jane Fosters. Oh wow, that's what happened when you barely pay attention, people. Um, matter of fact, I, no, I I took some resi I think I took my resolve down. That could be it. And now I got the health glitch. Glad I subscribed. I'm glad you subscribed too, Calvin. Appreciate it. What are the top five heroes and one villain you will want in the game? Top five heroes. Um, top five heroes I want. Well, one, I, will, I definitely will want... Um, Hyperion, if he can, if he can get on <laughs> in the rotation, I, I would be all about that. Um, behind him, I'm not sure. Um, 
Cause like I, I definitely want War Machine. Um, definitely want Doctor Strange. I'll take I'll take Ant Man and I'll take Scarlet Witch. I, I'll do it like that. Is that five? We got Hyperion, War Machine, Doctor Strange, Ant Man, and Scarlet Witch. Yeah. So yeah, that would be my top five. And um, let me see. You said villains too. Um, for villains, I definitely want Doctor Doom. I uh, I would want you know Hydra, so like you know Red Skull, um, Baron Zemo, people like that. I would I would definitely be for seeing them. Um, since they're planning to add um patrol mode I, I think they should include you know smaller villains and i think that's i honestly think that's something they're considering but yeah like smaller villains like whirlwind and um the serpent society and stuff like that i feel like it's definitely things that should be considered because it's like every everything doesn't have to be like a major large scale you know battle you know the, the avengers fight small you know small time villains all the time And for something like patrol mode, I think that would definitely work best with, you know, a, a major boss thrown in here and there. Graviton, yeah. I, that's another, I always, I always say Graviton, but it's like I'm, my mind's kind of all over the place right now trying to stay on top of chat and everything. Uh, yeah, it's like that's that's the the best thing about this being a Avengers property. Like, you have so much you can pull from, you know, and it's all about just making the right plays essentially. Doctor Strange would be fire, absolutely, absolutely. And like I said, they know it. You know, they they are not unaware. But yeah, you guys drop your rating for Jane Foster in the chat if you play with her so far. Like, what do you give her out of ten? Um, I was planning to do a review for her today, but I think I'll just have that up probably about a weekend. I want to play with her a little more. Um, I still haven't taken her in the raid or anything, so it's like I want to test out some more things with her before you know giving a final verdict. But um, I do like her so far. Now that you have a maxed out, you got her at a nine. You got her at an eight. Okay, man, ape would be cool, bro. Yeah, like I, I would, I would definitely, I would definitely take Mbaku as a villain sector in Wakanda. Am I doing a raid or OT? Um, we can. We once I finish this up, you know, we can, we can do that. Do you think that we'll get Iron Man's Guardian of the Galaxy suit as a style one day? Hopefully. Um, the the lead of the art team that I, I, I used to communicate with, he's no longer on the project. So it's like I, I'll have to figure out who to, who to push you know, ideas like that through to. But like um, me and him, we, we talked a lot about um, Thor's uh, Herald of Thunder um, skin. So I was out. <laughs> he 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 messaged me on Discord when that when that came through. I was like, okay. So they like I said, they definitely listen when they can. It's 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 not a hundred percent up to them. You know, if every decision were up to them, the game would look a lot different. But you know, they they have to follow guidelines and mandates and things like that. So they do what they can when they can. We got an eight point five. We got a nine out of ten. Uh, nine point five out of ten. Honest rating, where five is actually nothing bad but average. I would put her at six point five or seven. That's fair. And like I said, guys, you know, definitely feel safe with your opinions over here. Like you, you don't have to be overly positive about the game or anything like that. If, you, if that's not how you feel, that's not how you feel. <clears throat> you know, everybody gets to say everybody. You know has their own opinions and your opinions, you know, get respected over here. 
I think she I think she Hulk will not be so similar to Hulk because she is leaked from the beginning and her files are very complete. Yeah, she she won't be anything like Hulk. You know, not really. You know, she'll she'll be green and she'll you know, <laughs> transform and things like that. But you know, she she'll play completely different. Yeah, you can you can definitely tell her melee um, is her strong suit with the uh, with just how her combat is set up. And I'm you know I'm testing her out for uh, range first, but it's like I definitely have some pieces to test her out test out her melee too. Because it's like her melee is slow, but you know it is it can do a lot of damage. I played Thor a little bit yesterday just to see if he was on if his traversal and everything was fixed. But you know I, I still think I, I still would put Thor above her. Like you know Thor is still the goat in this game. Jane feels different to me when I play her. She's an eight. Yeah, like I said, I, I appreciate the the subtle differences between them, and I love her ultimate. Jane is a 10 out of 10. She is more fun than Thor, and he's my favorite character. Now she is my favorite character. Bro, like I said, I, that's the type of response the developers were looking for. So I'm definitely glad to hear you enjoying her <clears throat> and that she even took um, Thor's spot. So not only did she take his hammer in his name, she took his spot. Yeah, it's like uh, logically they they you know <laughs> cloned the best character in the game, so now you have two of the best characters in the game. So it's like I you know, it's <laughs> it, you know I understand being disappointed with it, but you know it makes sense from several standpoints. Where can I find any leaked She-Hulk clips? Um, currently nowhere. That. Hasn't been shared. I, I know Miller has said he's seen her, <clears throat> but he hasn't put that out there yet. So as it is, you are in the dark with the rest of us. But I'm hearing a lot of good things about her design. Like, you know, people are really proud of her design. Uh, Miller, he really likes her. He, he's really looking forward to Jen. up on chat <coughs> Quicksilver Wanda <coughs> Vision that would be crazy uh -oh. chat y'all ignore me getting beat up by aim bots while I'm trying to talk to you guys Um, I personally like to play other characters over Thor, but I 100% understand why people love him so much. I'm more of a melee player, so Cap and Hulk, but Hawkeye and Iron Man are bangers as well. Honestly, everybody in this game is, is dope, and you know it, it all comes down to you know play style preference, like you said. I love Captain America. I know you know he's not one of the the best characters in terms of like speed, damage, and stuff like that, but he. I love his combat. My Black Panther, I, I still got to figure out a build for him I'm comfortable with so I can play him more. But, you know, I, the melee combat is good. They just have to find a way to make it, you know, a lot more effective, similar to how um, ranged is. <laughs> R.I.P. Thor. <laughs> Kicked him in the mill there. Oh, man. Do you think we'll ever get Wolverine? Um, never say never, but right now, no time soon. It's there are other heroes they really want to focus on, and I, I, I don't know. I don't. I, I, it's weird. It's, it's a weird thing with the X Men and Marvel games because you see them pop up in other places like Future Fight and um, Future Revolution and you know Midnight Suns, and then you know something like this is like. It seems like they just don't have a green light to even come at all. So it's like, I really don't know. 
but you know like I said we we time will tell I guess is the best way I can answer that what villain do you think is suitable for the Cree invasion Ronan the accuser or the Cree overmind um Ronan the accuser like he he's you know more offensive I would say And guys, if you, uh, a good way to have your um, questions stand out in the chat is just at me in the, in, the, um, in your comment. And that way it kind of instantly pops on the screen so it grabs my attention. After seeing Multiverse of Madness, I want Wanda in the game. That would be dope. The developers know it. They know it. They are they are trying to get to that point. They are, they're trying to speed things up so that they can get to that point where they can get more you know fan favorite heroes added to the game so i think that's another reason they decided to kind of pull back on story content and not go as big and bold as they did in the past with like operations and stuff because you know they they want to put that time into actually getting more heroes and villains into the game what's your favorite character of the marvel series um it changes often you know, like in the comics my favorite character is probably spider-man um in the mcu my favorite character probably was captain america um no 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 let me let me change that my favorite hero in in the in the movies was black panther when he got introduced in civil war bro Civil War definitely did Black Panther justice. I keep forgetting she even got this kick. The developers really did a good job with the characters. Yeah, and I, you know, like I said, I understand people, you know, have criticisms and they have things they wanted specifically from the game and they want to see from the game, but I feel like how good they do with combat and gameplay and stuff like that is kind of get lost in the mix um, Jane is a eight for you being being fishing I'm hearing a lot of high um, ratings for Jane like I said I'm, I'm glad people are enjoying her like it's like I said it's something is it the best did she change the game not really but it's something we, we got something new to do you know for right now so leveling up Jane Figuring out her builds and stuff like that is something to do in the same content we've had for a while. And they're working on new content right now, so we'll have new content soon. So it's like, you know, just, just take what you can, you know, what you can get and appreciate what, they're, what they can do instead of always criticizing them for what they didn't do. And that's, that's how I see it. This triple God bless. It doesn't do nearly as much damage as I would like. Casual, I really like the Riskaya event. Was able to get a full set of 140 plus gear for each character when all was said and done. That was the thought process behind it. Like, I really like what they did with events. I think they could do better with um, some of the objectives sometimes. Like, you know, stuff like, you know, Jane having it. um... You just do tedious things. Like, I think they need to move away from tedious, but you know, actually giving people gear outside of playing the raid every week and stuff like that. I, I think that definitely was the right choice to make. Do you think we will get a Thanos raid in the distant future? Yeah. In the short term, no time soon. It honestly doesn't make much sense for Doctor Strange and Wanda to be in the game story-wise. They make the Kree invaders look like ants getting stepped on. I mean, I mean, you could say the, the same for Thor, honestly. And, you know, Captain Marvel, she's going to be cleaning them up anyway. So it's like, that's that's part of what the Avengers are. Like, they're the, the strongest heroes, you know, taking on some of the biggest threats. So they want you to feel strong fighting these, you know, threats. And that's part of the fantasy that they're trying to build on. So it's like having Doctor Strange added to the mix and, you know, Scarlet Witch is like, I'm, I'm all about it. 
again appreciate everybody who is just popping into the stream um like i said we are just talking avengers and running around with jane for a bit um if we can get to 100 likes that would be amazing appreciate you guys as always and we can do some raids and OTs that right after this mission after i finish this half i got one more floor and we can start filling up the the strike team Yeah, um, they, like I said, they did a great job with her hair. And, you know, that was something Miller teased way back in January when he first mentioned she would be coming and teased her as a mystery hero. You know, he was saying, you know, they did some interesting things with her hair. Come on, man. All right, let's go. Let me get through this. Three point five for Jane. <laughs> you really not liking her, huh? Or is that well no, that's out of ten, right? Three point five out of ten. Really not feeling her. Like I said, I, I like her design, I like her skill kit, you know, the the things that are different in the kit, you know, I like those things. think they did as best as they could given the circumstances surprised they made our hair all right i just read that one war machine gonna be a killer in the game all his big man absolutely absolutely anybody who thinks war machine is just a clone to iron man you know especially in this game is like you fooling yourself you're 100 percent fooling yourself War Machine's crowd control and DPS is going to be insane. He's designed to hit a little harder than Iron Man. Uncle, let me let these cats in the chat know that if they put that boy Rody in this game, he won't be seen as a carbon copy start. Not at all. I, I am not tolerating any War Machine slander in the chat. Especially in this game. Like I said, it's it's the combat in this game. Like, if they can make him shine in, in Marvel Heroes, they definitely can make him shine in this game. And you got the person who was responsible for that as a lead on this game. So it's like, sleep on him if you want to. Sleep on them if you want to. Yeah, you, you guys see this? This um, tornado that Hawkeye made? If they did something like that for James God Blast, I feel like, you know, that, that, was, a, that was something they could have explored. Or if they, you know, since they gave her the God Blast, she can have the old one and just tweak Thor's to, you know, have a big tornado or something like that. Just to add a little more difference between the two. Jane is a lot of fun, and I made her skill different than Thor. Like, I didn't get in the, any of the skill like I got Thor skill. Yeah, she is a lot of fun. Like, right now I'm kind of on autopilot, just trying to keep up in chat. Um, but I, I, I took her in the harm room and everything. She, she holds her own. Why am I even fighting them? Let's go press the button. But yeah, like stuff like this, I, I'm i not a fan of these kind of objectives, but it's like I also understand like if you don't do stuff like this, people like me would never play the halves because it's like, I, you know, the halves just aren't that interesting to me. Like I don't like standing on buttons and platforms and stuff like that, especially as when you're playing solo. If it was just, you know, beat waves of enemies in the hives, then yeah, that's fine. But, you know, having to stand on platforms and keep people off buttons and stuff like that is like, I don't want to do that. Like 
they gave a unique takedown for the um, adapt toys and dread bots and things so it's like you know just give them credit for what they did do instead of you know getting down on them for what you what they didn't do that you wanted them to do that's all i'm saying but if you're not super excited for jane that's 100 percent fair that's right no war machine slander here I wonder how tall She-Hulk will be. Um, she'll probably be a little shorter than Hulk. She definitely gonna stand out in the background on the main screen though. Mighty Tornado from Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3 would fit to Thor for a soft heroic. Yeah, like I, I, that's I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to pass that on to the dev team and see you know if that's something they want to explore in the future. But it's like yeah, that's that's something that would just help them stand out a bit more. Returning your you know, any target hit with the hammer will be a critical hit. Alright. Right, so we got some gear for. So we don't need this. So if anybody wants to hop in, you can join up on me, and we can roll. I love, I would love War Machine, Scarlet Witch, and Moon Knight. Yeah, 100%. 100% uh, bombardment skill for War Machine is what I'm hoping for. Yeah, like, you know the missile barrage that um, the Hulkbuster has? I'm pretty sure that's going to be in his skill kit. Something like that is either going to be a heroic or, you know, just part of his skill tree. Like, um, part of his, um, his ranged attacks. So, he'll probably have, like, a, a missile barrage, you know, option. Morning, Omega. You must be overseas. Appreciate you, you know, coming through. For War Machine, Warhammer Melee. Or Marvel Heroes Chainsaw Melee. Um, I'll take the hammer. I mean, the chainsaw would, you know, build up, you know, stun faster. So maybe, the, maybe, the, maybe the stun, um, the chainsaw. I was just thinking about fighting claw. And it's like I'm pretty sure that would, you know, build up stun pretty fast. What do you think is the best major artifact for Jane? Um, right now I have. I got the Sacred Norn Stone of Lethal Wheel, <clears throat> just to boost damage and um, buffs and all of that. People saying that War Machine is going to be an Iron Man Echo are the same people who think that Hawkeyes are Echoes, pretty much. But it's like, you know, that's, you let them have it. You just let them have that and you have fun with them. Uh, can't wait for She-Hulk. I'm, I'm ready for everybody. She-Hulk, Winter Soldier, War Machine, Captain Marvel, anybody else, Doctor Strange, whoever, whoever they have in the pipeline. I'm, I'm all about it. Um, I see we five likes away from 100. Slap that like button. Support the channel. Um, was the rumor you told us about, about a major content update or a major game overhaul? Um, so, one, that is a rumor, and two, it's... It's that's it's 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 big in concept, but it seems real pipe dreamish at this time. So it's like I'm not that's nothing I would share or pass on as or you know, even put out there as something that possibly could come because it's like that's that's way too too down the line to even, you know, tease people with you know, I I would rather talk about stuff that's closer to actually coming to the game. So I say he heard I, <laughs> I heard a rumor Doctor Strange, Scarlet Witch, Batman, and Superman were coming out this year. That's true. That's that's hundred percent true. Your source is legit. And guys, definitely go check out Sadat. Um, the link should pop up in the chat in one second. One of the biggest Marvel's Avengers streamers out there, 
and you know one of the best people on the platform legit cool laid back dude go join the do rag nation kick it with him show him some support help get him to 20,000 subs what's good bink appreciate you coming through when do you think we'll get captain marvel um some honestly it's looking like i don't i it's because her movie got pushed back to july of next year maybe mid mid 2023 and you know i don't know who would come before her you know in that time frame if if she does get pushed back and held back to her movie so we, we gotta see um i just want ultron yeah i want anybody new um like I said, if you guys want to want to hop in, you can. You know, if not, I'll do another half mission. It's a hundred percent up to you. Uh, no skins tomorrow. Like I said, we gotta wait and see. Um, I wouldn't want Hulkbuster and War Machine. Would rather him open up with all weapons and blitz the target. Yeah, he, I'm not saying he would hop into a, a Hulkbuster. I'm saying he would have um, a missile barrage similar to the Hulkbuster. Just to kind of, you know, because he covers a lot of ground and area of effect and stuff like that. Yeah, bro. Like I said, Doom um, signing me up for DSG Fight Club. That that kind of, you know, gave me the push I needed. You know, it's 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 nice though. You know, I definitely you know appreciate everybody hanging out with me. I see we got over a hundred likes in the chat. It's streaming is dope. It's it's a lot more free form. You know, I, I see why you guys like it. And, you know, like I said, I'm hoping to get better every day with it. I will, bro, I'm sorry, but you cracked me up when you said Jane Foster was fine. The only difference is her ultimate and her being a girl. I mean, she got completely different gameplay in terms of, like, melee combat and things like that. Like, she, I, I feel what you're saying, but, you know, I feel like that's also a little, you know, disingenuous about what she does compared to what Thor does. Like, if you look at her skill tree... It's several things in there that Thor just doesn't have, like, like this. Thor can't do that. That that little throw at the beginning, he doesn't do that. Yeah, we'll go through. Like yeah, it's like she is supposed to be Thor at the end of the day. So yes, they're gonna have a lot of similarities and stuff, but. Yeah, this is what I was looking for. So yeah, Thor, this he doesn't have this this kind of combo. This is kind of taken from Captain America's Brooklyn Brawler um, attacks. So it's like, yeah, they they got some differences in there. Yeah, she, what is that? Thunder Strike. Like Thor, he he doesn't work like that. Her hammer targets people on its own. Is you know, the list goes on. So it's like I, I get what you're saying, but at the same time, it's like they 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 made some differences between the two. How to join the strike team? Um, just um, look up my name. It's Casual Avenger 87. You see it right here. So just you know, find me on PSN and join up, or send a friend request if we're not friends already. Do I think War Machine will be taller? Um, I, I think they kind of keep everybody around the same height. Brayden, what's up, bro? Yeah, I remember you. I, I remember everybody who pops up and, you know, comes through and interact. I'm pretty good with names, pretty good with faces. So it's like, yeah, I, I got a solid memory for the most part. I'm expecting a few X-Men and Capcom characters to be added. Uh, in this game? <laughs> Might be playing the wrong game. Ant-Man will be the first character in 2023. I wish. Did I accept that? Okay. Um, maybe we will get Doctor Doom in the game eventually as he is coming to the MCU. Yeah, like I said, they... They're planning to add, you know, more villains soon. So it's like, you know, we just got to see. Wait and see what they bring. You trying to join Ivy? Um, yeah, just, um, what's your PSN? Drop your PSN. I'll just send invites. We'll do it that way. 
Yeah, it's, it's cool, the truth. Bro. Like like I said, it's you know, if you don't like it, that's 100% fair. And if you underwhelm with it, that's 100% fair. I'm not here to make anybody, you know, like her or, or shield for her or anything like that. If you don't like it, you don't like it, bro. That's fair. <laughs> we all don't have to like the same stuff and, you know, that your opinion is valid. Will Bucky be like an operation? Um, in a smaller sense, possibly. Like they they're still foc like they're still gonna focus on story elements. It just isn't gonna come in the big story package of uh, operation like we're used to seeing. It's basically the the idea that they're selling now. Hey bro, I I just added you. I'm a long time watcher of your channel. I get off in about an hour if you want to play some matches. Um yeah, if I'm still going by then, bro, we can definitely run. This is a shill only chat and not <laughs> no hate allowed. Hey, you can do what you feel as long as we keep it clean in the chat, as long as we're not, you know, targeting anybody or anything like that. You know, all opinions is valid. I'm just glad we got something. Xbox hasn't had a hero since Black Panther. Yeah, and that's, you know, that's been something, you know, that I've been taking into consideration. So it's like, it's something. Is it the best thing? No. I personally would have preferred War Machine, but, you know, we got something, so... Uh, if you can make any Thor gear piece with three custom perks that you made, what would it be? That is above my pay grade. I just play what play with what we got. Um, I leave the the gear to to the to the gearheads. I say that like I'm I'm not the gear man. <laughs> I'm not the person to go to for gear. Like I'm just kind of learning what's really good and what's what's kind of mid. But you know, it's like I'm. That's definitely not my expertise. Um, lead that to like Fate Walker and um, you know Bob Bob Duck and Weave. I, I honestly haven't been, really been doing anything. I, I've been playing her um, her mission chain a little bit. Like I do another half, but uh, I've been taking it slow. Ivy Marzell. All right, I got you. What are we? What are we doing? Are we already friends? Okay, okay. <laughs> My apologies. All right, let's get Ivy in here. Anybody else want to join? <clears throat> I should play on PC is dope. Um, yeah, either PC or Xbox or something. Like I'm, I'm definitely looking to get on another platform to play with. You know, more subscribers in the future. All right, we got Ivy in. Um, J Flash. All right, let me get you. Um, DJ, you still in the chat? Okay. Alright, we got a squad. Um Did you join up already, DJ? Like are you loading up? I hope we see more location of traveling, more mission in the game, we see. <clears throat> yeah, um, Brian, he, he made some comments about that um, yesterday about, you know, new environments and biomes um, being in the pipeline. Um, I think the first new environment you'll probably see is probably AIM Island, but, you know, we don't, I don't know how different that's, that's going to be. DJ, I just sent another invite for you. Yeah, once you load up, we can get rolling. I would like to play, but I'm only level 21. Um, go get, gr um, grab gear and hit up the gear vendors. Do a 
quick OLT. What character they got they going to put in the game? Um, you got a couple characters in the pipeline. You got Winter Soldier, you got She-Hulk, you got Captain Marvel, um, we hoping for War Machine, possibly Doctor Strange, you know, the future is bright. Um, yeah, we all missed the campaign story, one of the best to enjoy seeing. Yeah, the campaign was dope. I, I played the campaign a couple times. Um, especially back when it was cheese there, but yeah, it's, um, I, I like what they did with the story. I, I feel like they have they introduced one of the more likable um, versions of Kamala in gaming or Marvel games that I've seen. Well, I mean, they were the only game to ever focus on her, so it's like they were the first game to really give her the spotlight and you know give her a really good story and introduction and make her feel like a part of the team. I wish this game was cross-play because between all three platforms I'm on Xbox, I would want to play with you and your squad. Yeah, bro, like, um, if you want, you can check out Mammoth Ego and Dr. Awkward over on um, Twitch. They both are on Xbox, and they, they help people, you know, play raid content and game content, all of that, all the time. Yeah, you, um, if you guys are Xbox players, you know, definitely link up in the chat, you know, find new people to talk to. It's, it's always better to have a dedicated team of people to play with versus playing with, you know, matchmaking. Like, matchmaking is not the way. They finally fixed the Bifrost cheese. I know some people saw to you about it, but, you know, it is what it is. It was cheese, so. And, and it did completely break. Thor's gameplay, so <laughs> it's like to be fair. Let's go. I used the Valkyrie armor to make Jane look more like her own character. Yeah, and I, I believe that's why they made sure that was there day one. Um, and if you peep, she also has um, Unjarn as her main weapon in that skin. Which was another nice touch they did. looking forward to any other heroes any other superhero games like suicide squad yeah suicide squad looks dope um if you guys want like i um you know i think live streams might be the best way to start covering some of those other games so if you are interested in games like gotham knights you know um midnight sun suicide squad and you know you want to hear my thoughts on them just let me know and we will make a venue for that Hopefully we get, hopefully soon we get to see Asgard as a new base. Um, yeah, like, like they, they know that's the kind of stuff we want. It just takes a really long time to make stuff like that. So they will have to figure out, you know, outsourcing and things like that before fully committing to that. But, you know, they, they know you want to go more places and see more things in the game. So it's all about finding a way to make that happen. That works within, you know, the new system they're trying to, you know, establish. Okay, so he is out here. It was like, playing with Jane still feels a little off and awkward, but, you know, it's like Thor is just where I live. So we got two Janes and a Black Panther. This should go fine. I'm on PC, but I can play with Xbox people. See, that's that's one of the good things about Game Pass. Considering how, oh, <laughs> I forgot about that. Talus Gaming, appreciate you subbing, bro. Appreciate it. 
Um, considering how good James Maley is, I hope they rework some gear perks to do the same for Black Panther. Um, yeah, they... Uh-oh, somebody got kicked. Who that? DJ got kicked. All right. We can, we can, well, once we get out of the elevator, we can, we can back out. That's fine. What's up, Jorge? I'm, I'm chilling, bro. You see, we, we got a solid stream going, talking Avengers, playing Avengers, carrying people through the raid. I mean, not the raid, the OLT. It's a good day. to the clan jet all right dj we'll get you back in and we can try to run it right back uh, how's it going casual uh, someone took my sandwich what's up it's going good like i said i can't complain got a lot of dope people chilling with me in the chat came through spending a night with me can't can't complain we playing avengers my favorite game right now Solid night. Are you playing this Saturday? We can team up. Um, I, I gotta see. I got some, you know. I gotta figure out some car stuff. But um, if if anything, I'll, it'll probably be like an evening stream. So I, I may hop on like Saturday evening. All right. So DJ, I just sent you another invite. Uh, Jade is pretty good, bro. I like how fast her bar goes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, her intrinsic feels up pretty fast. Like I said, she's she she feels different enough, you know, in my opinion. Avengers! What's up, Noob Life Gaming? And not a noob. Appreciate it. Appreciate that, sir. Appreciate that. Thank you guys so much for subscribing and kicking it with me. And liking the video, supporting the video, supporting the channel. What's your game attack, Casual? So I can add you through Xbox. Um, I'm not on Xbox, Talus. I'm on um, PlayStation. But um, I, I plan on getting Xbox in the future just for the sole purpose of being able to play with people on Xbox. So um, once I get that sorted, we I will definitely let you guys know, and we can link up and play Avengers on Xbox. What's Vision chances of getting in? I think he, he got some pretty solid chances of getting in, especially with Ultron, you know, coming soon. Can't believe we won't see any of the X-Men, bro. Um, we just won't see him anytime soon. Um, no, I don't currently have Game Pass, Talus. Um, will you be doing more streams like this because I might want to play with you one of those times? Yeah. Um... I'm looking at doing subscriber, um, you know, like playing with sub subs on Saturdays. It's just all about, um, you know, figuring out logistics and everything. But that's looking like the best day, if not Sunday. But yeah, we definitely will be streaming a lot more in the future. Bro, the Fat Jedi coming through with the $5. Appreciate that. Love to the creator, love to the game, love to the community. Assemble. Shout out to the Fat Jedi. Love that name too. <laughs> Interesting names. All right, cool. We shall assemble. Yes, indeed. Uh, hot take, but I think I like Jane's playstyle more than Thor so far. Hey, that is a hundred percent fair. Um, I think you know Thor. His gameplay is just like solid. You know, old reliable. You know, you know what you're getting, but with you know jane is it's just interesting and, and different uh, especially with her ultimate so it's like you you know exactly what you're in for with her and again appreciate that super chat fat jedi appreciate that bro good to know thanks my play soon casual looking forward to it bro looking forward to it it would be nice for Ironheart, War Machine, Wonder Man, Tiger, Doctor Strange. You got a whole list. Um, like I said, the, the future is bright. As long as the game is rolling and they have, you know, 
resources and and time and vision you know we can we can do it all it's, it's just all about you know doing it you know the right way and within the right time all right gotta go have a good day appreciate you coming through splash look forward to kicking it with you in the future appreciate that um <clears throat> flossy jane got more finesse yeah she 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 does and she's a little slow though like with her her melee she is a little slower with the start than thor any chance for a spider woman showing up um she was in the original um <clears throat> data mine files so she could come back into the picture uh, like i said I'm, I'm all for anybody They can give me the shield carrier on um, the hella carrier janitor and I'll take him. As long as his combat is good, I'm with it. Wow. It feels so good playing with Thor without him, you know, A-posing and all of that stuff anymore. I forgot how good he, it felt playing with him. <laughs> he, was, he was broke for so long. Alright. Let's try this again. How likely do you see the Guardian showing up? Um, like I said, the future is bright. You know, any, anything is possible. Um, short term, no, I don't see them anytime soon, but, you know, post-2023 or late 2023, you know, hey, they do got a movie coming, so, that that is cross-promotion opportunity. I level up heroes because I need to level up Black Panther. Um, you gotta buy gear. Buy gear and open chest. We haven't progressed in getting tower back, bringing citizens slowly back home, or defeat name. And that's something they're looking to do. I, I'm not necessarily the you know fighting to get Avengers tower back. I think that's a fight that's probably gonna have to take place in court. <laughs> but um, you know, just just. Moving past the AIM storyline is something they're starting to work towards, and I think cloning labs is going to be a big part of doing that. Um, let me see. Has anyone else's Jane Foster's iconic outfit become locked after equipping a different suit? Um, I think I have heard that. Um, you might want to have you might have to pass that along on either Discord or on Twitter to the official um, accounts but um, I think the devs are aware of that and they might have a patch for that soon so let me try to catch up a bit do you think we are going to see any more humans in the game um yes and no not really at right now not really I don't think that's their focus and I don't, I don't think people care enough about the Inhumans right now for them to justify, you know, development on that. But, you know, would I like to? Yeah. Black Bolt is one of my favorite heroes in Marvel. I was, I was super hyped to see him appear in uh, Multiverse of Madness. Great video today, bro. Really excited that Bucky might come sooner rather than later. Man, absolutely. And um, you know, for anybody that just you know tuned into the stream, I was saying that the reason that I feel Bucky might, or, or the reason they might pivot towards releasing Bucky ahead of She-Hulk is just to kind of put some distance between her and um Jane, to you know kind of stave off the narrative that they're you know just issuing out you know clone heroes and echoes back to back. 
or you know they're only releasing female heroes this year and stuff like that just anything to kind of cut down on the negativity and the unnecessary you know bad publicity and stuff like that but like i said it's it's a hundred percent i didn't mean to do that that's what happens when you get used to using the on um, the bifrost cheese <laughs> I really hope that War Machine and She-Hulk get added to this game. Yeah, same. Like I said, they got a lot of dope people they can pull from. That players want that would work really well with the game. Like like I said, they would really just have to figure out something for um like somebody like Wolverine. They would have to figure out his range capabilities. But, again, I don't doubt that they could. And that would just be the only real hiccup for him. Why am I fighting you? Okay, I see they changed um, Thor's um, beam when he's um, flying too. I thought that was just something they did solely for Jane. They did take away his crits. Forgot about that. Let's see. Where did he go? some crits let's go I apologize chat let's focus up for a second I'm trying to get that guy out the way um do you think bucky will come with a story um not a major like like not a major operation story like a lot of a whole lot of cut scenes and stuff like that but you know something you know something on a smaller scale but yeah every every hero that comes to the game will have some kind of story um you know, so, you know, when you get hero events, the story is told through audio tapes and, you know, a cutscene. So, um, I think he'll have a little more than that, like what we saw with Jane and, and Spider-Man, but not as much as what you saw with, like, Kate or um, Black Panther. Do you think they'll bring in Scarlet Witch and Doctor Strange next year? I'm, I'm hoping they do. Um, they know we want them to, and they they are a part of the conversation. So I think they have a really good chance of making it into the rotation. Who's God blessing better? Um, right now Thor's because he he got the cheese. He has the cheese. If they do the X-Men, I'm pretty sure Wolverine just because he was a new Avenger. Um, yeah, if you, if you get an X-Men, it'll definitely be Wolverine before anybody. But, uh, well, I mean, they could they could go far left and, and give you Beast. Beast was a, um, was an Avenger too. So, but they they know people have been asking for Wolverine. So if if an X-Men is on the table, it, I'm more than likely sure it would be him. Great stream, bro. Always watch your videos. Keep up the good content. Appreciate that, Calvin. <clears throat> what are cloning labs? Um, that's the new content they have planned to release um sometime in the near future. So it's looking like possibly August. Alright. So yeah, that that'll be the new in-game mission. Um, where you fight Modok for the second time 
and different clones of bosses is what the assumption is. <clears throat> so clones are like Abomination and Taskmaster. I got the health book. Um, what would you want as a dream character? Mine would be Squirrel Girl, Cloak, and Dagger. Um, my dream character would be Hyperion. That's the closest thing we'll get to Superman in this game, and I'll take it. Black Panther, Sister, and Namor. Um, um, like I said, I'm, I'm all for anybody. Any Namor would be dope. Um, only reason I, I wouldn't be for sure is because like Black Panther, his, like right now he's not the best in terms of combat because he's you know primarily melee, and it's like you know you can you can build him range, but I, you know I, I don't enjoy just sitting there throwing stuff the whole time. I like to I like to play mix and you know throw in some um some melee in there, and it's like you know I, like I said I still got to figure out how to really build him, but it's like. I feel like if the, until they figure out melee and how to improve it, they should hold off on you know doing clones of you know characters like Black Panther. Yeah, Beast was an Avenger, Jorge. Look it up. Look it up. Scarlet Witch was an X Men enemy with Magneto as her father, and Scarlet Witch and her brother have also been Avengers. They were Avengers. Was Cloning Labs originally going to come out with Jane? Um, not not that I believe. I don't I don't believe that was ever the case. Could it have you know been the plan? Possibly. I mean, we got Spider Man with the raid, so they they could do it if they wanted to. Avengers! My dream character is Sentry, Clyde the Glad with the sub. What's good? Appreciate you. Appreciate you coming through. Appreciate that sub. Um, Sentry, I, while I appreciate him as a strong hero, I have, you know, like his his story is just so convoluted and boring. It's like, no, I'm, I, I'll take Hyperion over him any day. Um, do you think they will give War Machine the overheat mechanics like what Miller mentioned? Um, yeah, if he if he gets back in development, then yeah, they're gonna pick up where they left off. Uh, Silver, Gladiator, Angela, Gamora. I'm assuming you mean Silver Surfer. Um, that's that's a pretty cosmic team. So, like I said, they would have to take the game in a different direction story-wise, you know, for that kind of stuff to play out. But, like I said, anything is possible. Uh, we've been in here for a long time. Did anybody get kicked? Like Panthers on the wall. Okay, DJ got okay. And we cannot do anything. Alright, DJ, um yeah, I see. Um you you might have to just exit the mission. We'll we'll try to run something else with you. But we won't be able to move forward until you drop out. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's that's one of the downsides of, you know playing with between P PS4 and PS5 they still haven't figured out you know uh, a way to get more stability between you know PS5 and PS4 players which hopefully they do in the future but you know sometimes that's the kind of stuff you run into okay Let's 
Sentry. We got some Sentry fans in the chat. That's what's up. Spider Woman is your dream character. Yeah, Spider Woman is dope. Um, you know, any game that you know finds a way to include her is, is pretty dope in my opinion. She, you know, is not as popular as, as she should be as long as she's been around, but you know, that's because they don't really push her in, in anything major. You know, they they could feature her a lot more prominently than they do to help her, you know, kind of get a little more mainstream shine. Do you think we will ever get operations like Hawkeyes, Kate Bishops? Um, not really. Um, it, it seems like they're they're moving away from that. They, it just doesn't make sense, you know, from a resources standpoint. And that's not to say you won't get any story content. It just won't be the same as you've seen before. So we have yet to see what that looks like, you know, going forward. But it, you know, it doesn't sound like it's going to be the same you know as what we got in the past because it took a lot of resources just to put that stuff together so like you know war for wakanda they spent you know years put it, uh, over a year putting that together and you know people play that one time and, and you know just never really go back and revisit it so it's like that's a lot of time and resources for something that's not you know being replayed in a live service you know looter yeah, you know, the the focus of the game at this point should be in game. So anything that keeps players playing every week, and if it's not doing that, then it's not really worth the time and effort. You good, DJ? Hey, that's that's a hundred percent a networking issue. It's not it's not your fault in the least. And like I said, we'll get you right back in. If we were you know closer to the beginning like we did last time, I would have just hopped back out and tried it again. But uh, we can we can wrap this up in. Um, at with three people. Um, is there a Wonder Woman equivalent in Marvel? Yeah, you got a couple. You got Captain Marvel. You got Rogue. Um, you got people like Quasar. Um, Wonder Woman, like Gamora, in a sense. Like I did not like Gamora. You know, she she's nowhere near as powerful as Captain. I mean, as Wonder Woman, but. You know, kind of, you know, along the same lines as far as the, you know, warrior background. Doctor Strange, Scarlet Witch, Division, Hyperion, Namor, She-Hulk, War Machine, Ghost Rider. That is a list. Like I said, it's the reason people come up with so many, you know, heroes that they want to see in this game is because the combat is good. And it lends itself to being accessible for most heroes. Like, like somebody like Gambit would be amazing in this game. Somebody like Ghost Rider would be amazing. All right, so um, Black Panther, you just stay on the platform for me. Yeah, we can do the platforms. That's the next one, four. Four, five. Two. I hope they do something with Spider-Man, Xbox. The vibes going. I don't know where it's two. Yeah. Um. Hopefully they can revisit the you know PlayStation exclusive deal for Spider-Man. I don't know how likely that would be, but you know that is something I would like to see them do. You know, just because, you know, he, you know, other people do deserve to play with Spider-Man, not just PlayStation. Uh, I don't think that was a great move, especially, you know, right out of the gate. Like, that should have been a timed exclusive at best. So, PlayStation players get early access or something, but, you know, everybody gets them eventually. But, you know, like I said, a money makes the world go around. So, that was clearly a decision motivated by money. Um, will we get a Bruce changing into the Hulk emote? Um, possibly. If I can try to push that through and let them know that's something people would be interested in. And 
hopefully we see that come to the game in the future. Uh, Scarlet Witch used to be Magneto's daughter. Makes me wonder if they will change her back into his daughter again now that they get separated from Fox. Um, they could. I don't. I don't know if they feel like that's worth all of that. But you know, you never know. That's the interesting thing about all of this Marvel stuff. We never really know what they're thinking. They should do more Young Avengers. Yeah, they should do more Young Avengers to put spot, some spotlight on them. Yeah, I agree. Um, And I think they have stuff like that in mind. So it's like, you know, if they hold off Captain Marvel until her um, her movie comes, I feel like you could see somebody like America Chavez come as a hero event. Honestly, I'm hoping like we can get like War Machine you know, early next year, but you know, we'll see. Athena, yeah, yeah, Athena is definitely like Wonder Woman. Appreciate you throwing that in the chat, cause I, I, you know, I'm, I'm not the most versed in the uh, Eternals, but you know, she, she definitely has Wonder Woman vibes, especially in the movie. Um, do you think this game will ever support crossplay? It sucks that I can't play with friends. Um, I actually have a video coming out on that, but, you know, in short, yes, that's something they're exploring. They don't have a solution for it right now, but they are actively looking into trying to get to work around that. So, you know, as, as they would say, nothing to announce, but, you know, that it is something on, on their radar because they know that would greatly help with, you know, just matchmaking and things like that, but... Honestly, they would they would really need to you know make sure stability is is there because you know as you just saw you know we we struggling between PS4 and PS5 so you know, I would imagine that would probably get a little wilder between Xbox and PS4 or you know PC and PS5 and stuff like that so you know that's that's the beauty of it being a live service game though like you know. Things change. Things can, you know, get better and improve. It's, you know, the game is always improving, and it doesn't have to just be one thing. So, like, you know, games like Spider-Man, you know, Marvel Spider-Man, that game is what it is. You know, Guardians of the Galaxy is the game that it is. It's nothing they can do to change that game. But this, you know, this game has changed a lot between release and now. So... You know, just just stick with them. You know, see where it all goes. You know, that's that's my philosophy. Let me catch up on chat. Um, do you think the Falcon will be added in Avengers? Um, I do. I, he has a movie coming out, so I feel like that. Any anybody with a a major Disney Plus show or movie coming out now that they're really focusing on you know like brand and synergy and things like that i feel like anybody with a major movie coming out has a, a good chance of being added That is the OLT, ladies and gentlemen. We need Shang Chi in this game, or Shang Chi. He would be dope. I did a video. He was. <laughs> we had some some incredible leaks that dropped for him back when I first started the channel. And again, like I said, because of the gameplay, he, I think he would be dope in this game. Do I think he's in the pipeline? Not right now, but you know that can change. Black Knight would be cool in this game. Everybody would be cool in this game. You can you can put me in there and I'd be cool. 
That's how good the gameplay is. Do you have a favorite villain in Marvel? Um, yep. Baron Zemo slash Doctor Doom. I think both of those are really, really good villains. Um, like I said, it's a list. Like, you know, but, you know, right at the top, you know, I would go with Doctor Doom. Uh, I got so much gear that I don't use or need for this guy. All right, DJ, let's try to get you back in. Um, Ivy and Jay, if you want to run again, you can. If not, you can you know, hop out. I'll probably run another OLT to try to get DJ through it. But appreciate you guys running with me if you do decide to leave. If you stick around, the more the merrier. Would you be interested in playing a villain Marvel game? Um, depends on the villain. Um, Loki would be dope. I mean, like, I, I would, I like, I would like to play with Doctor Doom or, um, you know, Baron Mordo or somebody like that. Um, Baron Zemo, I mean, Graviton. I, I play with a villain. Bro, how can I get to level 175? So to get the one le to level 175, you want to play missions like the Omega Level Threat Mission or the Raid, or you want to focus on doing the um, event objectives. So you want to go to your um, event, and this exotic gear will give you gear that's oh higher God. higher than level 140. Tony Shark with the sub. Appreciate that, bro. I know you're just sticking around for those those supposed leaks and rumors that I supposedly know, but um, I appreciate the sub anyway. And like I said, like I said, bro, when that if I get any credible, you know, inclination to that source, you know, like if that becomes credible in any way, I will definitely present that to you guys because it it is dope, but it's like you know it's. Because it's so far out and because it's, you know, it's pretty big, it it makes no sense to, you know, promote that right now on such a loose, you know, it's, it's nothing supporting it. And, you know, me and, I, I don't want to say too much, but, you know, I'm looking into it. Do I have a Discord channel? Um, I'm working on that. I, I should have one maybe by the end of next week. So I got I just got to sit down, you know, plan it out and set it up, and I'll definitely get that set up for you guys. Um, a dare, Daredevil game needs to happen. Yeah, Daredevil game would be dope, especially um if they do like his um his vision where like he sees the world on fire, like you know, you kind of like um, Arkham Knight. I mean, Arkham, you know, the Arkham games where you have the detective vision. So just something like that for Daredevil would be dope. You know, to let them see through walls and things like that, locate enemies. You could do a lot. You could do a lot with a solo Daredevil game. The competition you guys have, Marvel's Villains versus current Marvel game. What's up, Sean Yeager? Appreciate you coming through. There's possibly a Wonder Man. There's a possibility for Wonder Man. He have a Disney Plus show. Yeah, that's that's pretty much my thinking. If you if you got a Disney Plus show that that bumps up your uh, <laughs> your chances of getting in this game a little bit, at the least. And Wonder Man, that's another one of my favorite heroes. Like you know. Like I said, I got scatterbrain because I'm trying to, you know, multitask with, you know, helping get people through the OLT and keep up with chat. But, yeah, Wonder Man is, he's one of the most underrated, you know, Marvel heroes. And, you know, he, the fact that he got, like, the Johnny Cage style personality is hilarious. And, you know, he, I think he would be an amazing addition to this game. He can fly. He can project energy. He's he got super strength. You know he funny. I take him in a heartbeat. I feel like Doctor Strange 
could, should have been added this year because this movie came out a month ago instead of Jane, who I never heard of. Um, well, Doctor Strange would have took a lot more time and resources because he would be a completely original character that would have been built from the ground up. So, I understand why they, you know, didn't decide to do something like that. Also, you know, he, I think they have a specific narrative they want to tell with him. So, that that takes a bit more planning than like you don't you don't want Doctor Strange to just get slapped into the game like this, especially if you're big on story. You don't want him to just get dropped with a you know motion comic trailer and some audio files. You 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 do a little bigger and better for Doctor Strange, and the same for like Captain Marvel. Like War Machine, I would take as a hero event, but you know the bigger heroes is like nah. You you show him a little more respect. Yeah, I do understand. News articles will start writing about it and stuff, even though it could be fake. Yeah, and that's that's basically it. And it's like, you know, it's the source he told me, you know, he, he let me know that it's it's not something he's ready to run with. Like, he's still looking into it himself, but it's it's on the table. It's just something that's, you know, it's, think of it at best as an idea. So it's like, it's, it's no reason to get you guys excited about a really big idea that may never even, you know, come to fruition. So it's like, that's, that's my logic on it. Now, if this was concrete, I would have I would you would you would have saw a video on it ASAP. I would I would have made a video on that ASAP, but it's it's not it's not that. And again, he you know I I I don't like to burn bridges, and I like to value people, you know, having confidence and you know faith, and I try to have some integrity. So it's like you know I'm not that eager for a news story to you know just run off half cock with half ass information that at best is just an idea so it's like that's that's what i'm saying but yes they they have some interesting things they are working on and that they want to do that's that's the main takeaway they they have a lot of ideas and they're finally getting the freedom to explore some some bigger ideas that you know they have a bigger team they're still hiring people um, Brian was just posting about four new designer jobs today, so it was like, I didn't mean to do that. Appreciate you, Thor, picking up the slide. But yeah, it's like they, they have a lot of stuff they want to do. It's just about giving them the resources and the time to be able to do it. One demanding Grim Reaper. Yeah, I would definitely take, take him with his brother. Grum Reaper is another dope villain. Like I feel like the um, if you guys watched um, Avengers: Earth Mightiest Heroes, they they really did a great job showcasing um, the Grum Reaper in that show. Like he he was just the right level of badass in that show. Oh, I miss. I missed. All right, they're trying to take me down. All right. All right, we got some time. Do you think we'll ever get any more Marvel game announcements this year? Um, possibly. They just they have um apparently they got an EA game. Uh, EA has a Marvel fighting game in the works. So you know, you never know. They got Marvel Snap. You know, they've mostly been you know introducing new mobile games. But you know, we could get bigger Marvel games. Um, they, I forgot her name, but there is a, there's another Marvel game in the works too. I think it was rumored to be like a Fantastic Four or Ant-Man game or something like that. And then you got Spider-Man 2 and uh, Wolverine right around the corner too. Well, Wolverine might be 2024, but Spider-Man, <clears throat> Spider-Man 2 is next year. Unless it gets delayed.
again, appreciate everybody who came through tonight. <clears throat> appreciate you if you if you're new to the channel or you're new to the chat. You know, drop a like if you're enjoying the video. That definitely helps support the channel, and it is free. And you will be 10% more of a better person. As big a character Dr. Strange is, I want the team to take as much time they need for him. He's too big to just plop in there. Yeah, I, and I think that's the sentiment. They they understand. Like, Jane is, you know, she, she's just another version of Thor, and they understand that. So it's like, yeah, you don't have to do a whole big, you know, spiel about her. And, you know, I mean, they, they clearly could have, you know, with the, the Loki and Odin storyline angle. But, again, that's more time and resources. And the idea was just to get her out before the movie. So to be able to do that, it would just have to be her. And, you know, we have to cut corners where we can and where it makes sense. And that's pretty much the logic that was used when, you know, developing her. I got a question. Is it good to go full exotic and gear? Um, you can. It's, I mean, it's, it's gear that's serviceable, that's not exotics, but, you know, you really, you wouldn't be going wrong if you went full exotic. Like, I don't think I have all exotics, but, um, well, at least not on Thor. But, yeah. Let me grab time. Does Brian have a Discord? Um, he does, but it's pretty dry. Like he, you know, but since he's taken over as the um, lead designer, is is pretty much dead at this point. So it's like, you know, you, you really wouldn't. Get, and he he doesn't really talk the game over there. So you know, if you're looking to get some insight into the game, that definitely isn't the place to to, to find it. Like, he used to stream, you know, pretty often, too. But, you know, again, since he's taken on a bigger role, that just isn't a thing as much lately. All right. I feel like, I feel that if they do a Civil War, it would bring, a, bring like, a PvP mode or something like that. Yeah, I don't think they have any intentions of doing PvP in this game. Like, they... The balancing issues alone, I, I, I just don't think they're looking to have that kind of problem. <clears throat> but, you know, I agree it would be dope. And, you know, I, I know that's something, you know, a lot of players would want. But, you know, like I said, I don't think that lines up with, you know, their current vision for the game. DJ can stay with us this time and we can get through this bad boy. J Flash. Alright. <clears throat> I feel that if they do a civil war it would be okay, yeah, I read that one. Uh Nolan North also could have been Deadpool if he was in this. I think they would have went with a fresh voice if they chose to include Deadpool. But again, it's like that's another hero I think would be dope, but I don't think he fits their current, you know, plans for the game. Can we do the raid out there? Um, yeah, we can. We can do the raid, I guess. Let me see. Yeah, we can do a raid. Right, casual, I gotta go. Have a good night and have a fun rest of the stream. Appreciate you coming through. Someone took my sandwich. I hope you get your sandwich back, bro. Get that sandwich back. And appreciate you coming through as always. Falcon is someone I can see in this game 100%. He, he makes sense for multiple reasons, and he has a movie coming up that they can capitalize on. So, 
I feel like he has a pretty good chance of making a roster in the future. And he was originally planned to be a future DLC character, you know, originally, so. Let's see. Um, bro, I need a team on Xbox. Um, if you guys are on Xbox and you looking for other teammates, definitely link up in the chat. Definitely link up in the chat. And help each other out, you know, help get each other through the raids and the OLTs and stuff like that. Like I said, I'm working on getting an Xbox. Uh, the, the day that I grab one, I'll definitely let you guys know so we can link up. I can level up heroes pretty pretty quick, so that that won't be a problem. And just, you know, being able to run. And, you know, that'll let me run with some of my other creative friends and everything. So it's like plenty of motivation to go on and get it. Just... Got other priorities right now, so it's like I just gotta find out a way to get it in the pipeline. Um, R. Kelly got 30 years. Play with fire, you get burned. You gotta. Hopefully, he learned some lessons while he's in there. Let me see, let me see. You definitely need Ghost Rider in this game. He would be so sick. Imagine his abilities. Yeah, I mean, we we need to explore some other stuff before we get to Ghost Rider. And then, like, both in terms of heroes and you know just traversal, because it's like I don't I don't want to bunny hop around with Ghost Rider. If you bring Ghost Rider, I want I'm, I'm I want to ride the motorcycle. So it's like. Let's let's you know get some sky cycles or something in, in traversal and and go from there. So like on certain maps, you know traversal should you know include you know different vehicles or something like that for non flyers. Um, how high of a chance do you think they might add Ant Man for his movie release? Um, like I said, major movies and shows, I feel like you got a pretty good chance of being added. Pradismo, you want Silver Surfer and Moon Knight? Um, and guys, um, Pradismo, appreciate you with that sub, bro. Um, don't worry about Nightbot um, removing your comment. I still saw it. Um, I, I still gotta fine tune it a bit. I think he got you for all caps, but you know, like I said, I, I, I'll smooth all of that kind of stuff out, you know, by the next stream. But appreciate the um the sub. Struggler Brian in the chat. Shout out to Struggler Brian. That that is the raid king right there. If you need help getting through the raid, that is the man to see. That is literally what he does. Gets people through the raid and the end game content. Um, Nate the gamer. Um, Okay, um, guys, he dropped his, his Xbox game tag in the in the chat. So if you're on Xbox looking for people to team up with, Nate's got you covered. All right, three. On um, DJ, if you can you can do the the platforms for me so I can catch up on chat. So we got two and five next. I'll stay on the platform. Jeeps and Wasteland and Snowy Tundra snow, Snowmobiles. Yeah, like I said, Sky Cycles, you know, things like that. Simple stuff they can do. Alright, well, uh, I guess I'll go ahead and get this. Alright, and five. Bro, 
up some time. Um, hey, bro, I'll be on in about 30 minutes. Do you think you'll still be on? Um, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll still be on. I'll stay on to get a run with you. You want to show me your skills with Miss Marvel? All right, I'll stick around for you, bro. Like I said, we're just hanging out, chilling, talking Marvel's Avengers rumors. I got you. I got you, Ivy. we got let's see it's good to run with a team or by yourself on missions um depends on how you built your character and how you handle yourself um, if you can handle it on your own then yeah you know running it solo is definitely a, a a blessing in most missions but you know if you can't then you, know, you gotta do what you can yeah. I'll probably get up and stretch in a bit and sit and still for too long. Um, besides the elite characters, I want Quicksilver, Shang-Chi, America Chavez, Moon Knight, and Loki. That man has a list. Like I said, the developers they hear they hear your request with stuff like that. It's all about you know finding the, the time and space between what they want to do and where they can you know f fill in those kind of gaps. You know some some heroes obviously are going to be a little more likely than others, but you know like I said, they they hear it all. They they uh, <laughs> got to get time. I mean not time the platforms. Three, four, one, and five. All right, bro. Let me know. I'll be here for you. Yeah, appreciate you guys coming through for the evening stream. We got 150 likes on the video. We we are doing solid. Alright, he tried to shoot me. the second phase or something I don't even remember um, okay. we got you Four. machine with Winter Soldier maybe. Are, are you talking about in combination like at the same time? Because that is not happening. I would love it but it's, that is not happening. <laughs> not in this game. <clears throat>
yeah, like I got a, I got a lot of fun ideas about stuff we can do, like when playing with subs, like you know, giving you guys a chance to show off some of your builds. You know, let me see what you can do. Oh yeah, um, I meant to ask you guys this too. Drop a one in the chat if you would be interested in seeing, you know, other Marvel games like Ultimate Alliance one and two, and you know, just stuff like that. Um, if you got anything specific in mind, you know, you can drop that in the chat too. Cause I do have those. I, I got both games on PS5, and I haven't played them in a while. They both got, um, they still got multiplayer options. We got a couple yes sirs and ones in the chat. Like I said, if you guys want it, I'm all about it. Can't create. Appreciate the sub. Uh -oh. Am I getting Midnight Suns? Um, probably. Um, am I dead or am I alive? I'm confused. I got health, but I'm down. Appreciate that sub I can't create. Oh. Uh, we got wiped. All right, I'll focus up this time. Fate Walker in the chat. What's good, bro? Check out Fate Walker. Over on Twitch, if you want to learn how to build support characters for Marvel's Avengers, that is the man to go to. I wish they would do spinoffs for characters. I want the rest of the Avengers, Guardians of the Galaxy, X-Men, Fantastic Four, and Humans. Man, I, so you want everybody. You want the Marvel Universe. I got you. I got you. You want Marvel inside of Marvel's Avengers. Like I said, bro, the, f the future is bright. The future is bright, but definitely check out Fate Walker. That, that is the numbers, man. He is, he's the reason why we know how well things work in the events and how, how to use Kate Bishop in the raid and things like that. Like, that's one of the most efficient Kate Bishops you will find in Marvel's Avengers. And he plays on PC. So, PC players, that's the, that's the man to see right there. You can also check them out with um, Bob, Duck, and Weave. You know, they always play together on PC. You know, getting people through content, giving us the numbers, giving us the, the best advice for builds and things like that. That's what I was looking to do. Get the damage buff. And that's another OLT down, folks. Uh, we just running some OLTs, Fate. Um, we about to run a raid now. Um, Jalen asked to run a raid, so uh, try to get them through the raid. Appreciate that, Fate. Appreciate that. Um, guys, definitely like the, the stream, man. It helps the channel. It helps YouTube push it out in front of more eyes. And that definitely helps the channel for free. Now, raid with randos. I am not that strong, struggler, bro. I, I don't have your, your Iron Man skills. 
Um, I might switch over to Iron Man to get through this raid, though. Alright, um... Um, anybody want to volunteer to jump out so I can get Jalen in since he asked to run the raid? Um, appreciate you guys all coming through as always, though. And it was a pleasure running with all of you. DJ hopped out. Appreciate that, DJ. Um, Jalen, drop your PSN in the chat so I can get you in. Struggler Bri is another person you should definitely follow over on Twitch if you want to get through the raid and you're on PlayStation. His Iron Man can... He's the most efficient Iron Man player. He can get through the raid. He set the one of the fastest world record speeds, you know, for completing the raid on stream in a competition. So, he met, the man definitely knows what he's doing. You already in, Jalen? Oh, UJ Flash. Okay. So, um, DJ, I can get you back in then. can run this raid sometimes never enough time in the day to run everyone we can through the raid yeah that's the truth that's the truth but the more efficient your team is the faster it goes and the more people you can get through the raid that black panther reminds me of indiana jones which one um Thanks for letting me do this. I struggle with anxiety, so this really helps me. Think. Oh, uh, no problem, Ivy. Like I said, this this is 100% a chill spot. So if you need help with content or you need help, you know, doing anything, and I'm on stream, you know, feel free. And if we're friends, and you see me online, or you know, you want to hop in and run some content, feel free. Definitely no need for anxiety over here. Avengers! Arc, Archangeli Rosalise Martinez. I hope I said your first name right, but I appreciate you subbing to the channel. Uh, Ivy had to leave, I guess. Okay. All right. Um. Anybody want to hop in and run this raid? Brian, you you want to help carry us through this raid? If you hop in, I can switch over to Thor. You got kicked, Marzell. I can get you back in. That says you already added. So I guess you're joining back in. Um, is Hyrule still running for all guys? I, I got a feeling he's going to make me end up downloading that again and playing it with him. Alright, let me see if I can get you back in. Ivy. Alright, so I'll just back out and recent invites. Try to get everybody back in. DJ, Ivy, and J Flash. All right, Casual, I need to prep for Sunbreak release in 2.5 hours. Thank you for what you do. Keep being amazing as you always are. Glad I can catch you again. Fate, always appreciate seeing you coming through, bro. I, you know I, I'll, I'll pop up in the stream <laughs> playing the Jurassic Park chicken song. <laughs> We definitely are cross paths, bro. You know, have a good night. Melody, you're on Xbox? Um, we got people dropping their game attacks in the chat, so if you need to link up with people on Xbox, you know, we, we got you covered. Oh, uh, yeah. 
That that song is amazing, Fate. Alright, so we'll just go ahead and start it up and see who we can get inside from there. So we just need the four for the raid. Anybody want to hop in? Anybody want to join? I guess DJ was done for the night. Yeah, I've seen um, Old Man Logan's story, Ronnie. It's amazing. That's one of the best Marvel stories in recent years. I, I love most of Wolverine's stories. Like He's one of the most interesting heroes in Marvel. From Chicago, you you tell me. I might be. Oh man, Hawkeye and Wasteland are already in the game. Yeah, that's true. Casual, if you need another help, I'm free. Uh, hop in G Skills or um, drop your PSN. You know, whoever's free and, and wants to raid, we can do it. We can do it. Yeah, like I said, GS skills or Gen Rubu. You know, either one of you guys drop your um, PSN in the chat, and I will scoop you up so we can do the raid. And Ivy and J Flash, I appreciate your patience while we figure this out. Michael McAlester, what's up, bro? Dark Knight Rubu. All right.
<laughs> okay, never loaded it up from there before. No, not to do that again. All right, I'll get invite sent out for everybody in a minute. <laughs> uh, something went wrong. Do I think Ghost Rider will have a chance in this game if he was an Avenger? Yeah, absolutely. Ghost Rider, one of the strongest heroes in Marvel. You love the auto pin from Jane? Yeah, that's definitely dope. She she has a pretty dope kit. You know, the things that aren't like direct copies of um of Thor. Yeah, she she has some interesting stuff. Jen, did you accept the um, friend request? Sent. Everybody should be good. Oh, that's my profile name on Xbox. All right, we got another Xbox user in the chat. Um, I should have a full team, but we got to see who all joins up. I just sent out invites. So let's see. Let's see who all joins up. And now the raid is gone. Says you join, okay. All right, one sec. Let me see. Um, did you guys um um click launch mission? That that'll bring you onto the helicarrier. Yeah, I, I definitely don't see one above all coming into this game. So yeah, Ivy, if you just press, um, yeah, there you go. There you go. Um, if one of you guys can select the raid, because it's not showing up for me. And I don't want to have to reset the mission. Or, uh, restart the game.
fire thing. Ooh. So let me switch back to Iron Man before anybody rises up. Who else do I want to see on this game? Um, I got a list. I want Bucky. I want War Machine, I want She-Hulk, I want Captain Marvel, I want Doctor Strange, Scarlet Witch. Um, I want Wonder Man, I want Ant-Man. <laughs> uh, I want them all. I'll take um, America Chavez. Uh, okay, I thought we was about to have another crash out. What the hell are they talking about? Oh, I defeated. What is it? Um, uh, everybody press hold start so we can so I can try to switch heroes. I want to try to switch over to Iron Man. If everybody can vote yes, there you go. Yeah, this vote system is, uh, we gotta talk about that. It's not working as intended. If I finish eating, then I might join you, but... And if I don't, then... Okay, at least I'll enjoy the stream. Yep, I'll be around on uh, Rage Duff. So everybody drop your favorite, you know, hero in the game so far in the chat. Who are you main? Like right now, I'm our uh, main Thor for the most part. cap but it'll be Bucky when he drops uh, yeah yeah Bucky is definitely taking somebody's spot when he drops for me same with War Machine wow <laughs> they did me like that <laughs>
we got Iron Man. What else? You really want them to do the X Men? Yeah, you're not alone. Trust me, you are not alone. You currently main BP despite he's weak. Hey, that's solid, bro. Like when when Black Panther first dropped, you know I was loving it, but it's like I don't want to spend like 20 minutes fighting every enemy. Like uh, I want to be able to get it over with, you know, a lot sooner than that. Thor, Iron Man, Thor. Okay. Alright. So what do we got? We got Kamala, we got Black Panther, and we got Jane Foster. So this will not be a fast rate, but we can manage to do some things. Do you see the spider likes to fall on top of people? Sneak in some hits. Hybrid tanky Black Panther with Sonic and Vibranium is your main right now. That sounds like a solid build. Like I said I love Black Panther's combat. Like his his attacks and animations is dope. And I just you know I don't want to feel like I'm doing a decent amount of damage when I'm attacking stuff. I don't want to you know fight one robot for 15 minutes. Alright, um, everybody get a platform and I'll, I'll press the buttons on the consoles and try to cover you.
Has anybody in the chat not ran the raid? No, you never did the raid before? Okay. Um. Okay, so it's three platforms. So. Avengers! Okay. Ooh, we got subbing. Fancy Shark Man, appreciate the sub. Some buttons. All right, the bubble is up. I got him, Black Panther. Yes. Everybody get on the platform. I wish I couldn't run it, but I can't. You wish you could run it, but you can't? What's wrong? Why you can't? Ronnie's never done it. has attempted it once never completed would love some, some discord gear for cap They're going down. So somebody get Black Panther up. That's taking a lot of time. You guys gotta just stay in the shadows once the um the white phase come.
appreciate the help, Ivy. And the bubble is up. Uh, you guys can come if you want to. Um, I haven't actually ran um, Jane through the raid yet. I've been still, you know, doing her mission chain and everything. I'm going to an escape room for the first time. Um, definitely let me know how you like it. I've never done an escape room and I don't have any major plans of doing it. But it is an interesting concept. Thor, uh, one seventy five, level fifty. Since we got nine flyers, we can go to the left first. Many steps are for Jane. Um, I believe it is just five steps, if I remember correct. Are you serious? That's one thing that happened. Uh, Ivy, if you can pick me up, that would be appreciated. I'll watch it back. Yeah. All right. Everybody. 
probably should be on this side. Leave them down, Ivy. Let them stay down. Oh, now you're down. you guys respawn you'll be over here with me all right uh, anybody got questions about the rate like about how to get through any parts or how to do anything If you got questions about you know leaks, rumors, things like that, you know, drop them in the chat. Alright, um Yeah, just go to the console over there. And once everybody's ready, we'll do the countdown. Alright, three, two, one, go. guys three two one go okay everybody pressing the button okay so we on go you want to hold square and um you know get through this phase three two one go Turns green, we good. All right. I'm at four right now, but it's going slow. Yeah, they they made it kind of tedious, but you know they. Wasn't expecting you to do it all in a day or two. Um, Aaron, yeah, we can. I can definitely get you in after this, right? All right. So I need. I just need one of you guys to stay on this platform right here. And hold this door for me. All right, so stay right there. I'll be right back. And now, all right, everybody, follow me. We're coming right up here. All right, leave that one to you. Forty one. 
one seconds on it. Just make sure you keep that one down. Looks like we're only gonna get two this phase. Somebody to hold this door for me. Alright. Um, any new Jane scans today? Um, not announced, but you know, they didn't announce any scan. Standing on the door. Okay. Um, I need you guys to open that door again so I can get in. Wait, wait, there's four, not fish. I'm tweaking. All right, I see you. I see you, Black Panther. Let's go. I can't beat the OLT boss ever, even with Jane. I um, probably just need to put a little more, um, you know, precision or valor in your build. Get more damage going. Make sure you guys are holding that door. I'm on my way back now. Alright. And we're going to the far side. So you guys can come up here on this platform. for you guys. And we got 20 seconds to get it down. Make 
Make sure you guys get that down. Ethan, I can help get you through the LLT, man. Don't worry about it. Oh. Get cover, get cover. They tried to set us up. You gotta be quicker than that. Alright, so I'm going to show you the cheese for this one. Let me just run across these buttons. No, you don't have to stand on it. We're just, we just going to run across it. You can you can hop off um, Dark Knight. Yeah, hop off. And then, there we go. You don't have to stand on it. No standing on buttons. Everybody through, don't stand on any buttons. I will do this one. So do not touch any buttons. And we will get through this pretty quick. Alright, get in the shadows. BPN Kamala, let's go. Yeah, I got you, Ethan. No worries, bro. We did two um OLTs earlier. The adapt toy is no match for my Thor. Who ran on the button? Do not run on the buttons. Leave the buttons alone. Somebody grab Dark Knight. Alright. Alright, so we got one more door, I believe. Yep. So everybody, once we get through this last door, you just want to make your way up top. So follow me, we'll go up top, and all the enemies will spawn. Um, Ivy, we up top. There you go. And now the enemy spawn, and we can get through this. Good stuff, casual, helping them out like this. You know, they truly appreciate it. Yeah, bro, like I... I'm all about helping people. Um, you know, I feel like it's a good mission. It's good mission content, but it can be frustrating if you don't have a good team with good communication and things like that, or you know, you don't have good builds. So it's like it's. I'm always open to you know helping people out. You know, paying it back. Said if you're struggling with in-game content, I I can help get you through it. If you're on PlayStation, if you're not on PlayStation, I can point you to some people on Xbox and PC who can help do the same on that platform. All right, let's get this out of here. Somebody doing a takedown. You know, I say like, what's going on? All right, guys, follow me, and we're gonna do the buttons again. So on go, we're gonna hold square. 
One, two, three, go. They'll drop scans tomorrow. Um, they'll probably get something. You gotta go for now. Hope the raid goes well. All right, newbie life. Appreciate you coming through, bro. Catch you on the next one. Are you getting Thor Iron Man scan tomorrow? Um, like I said, it's possible. The Thor one, I doubt it. I doubt you see that one until we get closer to the movie's release or the week of the movie, but Iron Man is possible. Okay, guys, so for this part, um, one, someone has to be at the bottom of the forge, and someone has to go up top, so come... I need one person down here with me and everybody else. If you've never done this before, just hang back for a sec. So, um, Black Panther and Kamala, you would be best for down here. So, link up with Jane. And I'll take care of the rest. So, we got fish. So if anybody got a mic and you want to call out the sim the symbols, that'll help. But if not, I can just come back down and check. Greatest ever. Okay, appreciate the sub. Appreciate the sub. A lot of support, guys. Appreciate that. And it was down that row. Appreciate that sub uh, from the greatest ever. Um, I'm on PS5, so I can play with you sometime. Yeah, Ethan. Like I said, send me a, um, a friend request, that casual Avenger, if we're not already friends. Uh, yeah, that's facts, man. A lot of people don't take time to do that, and it's good to see and helps the community grow. If you ever need another 175 player to help you out with new raid players, I can. Appreciate that, GI Skills. Um, if we're not already friends, send me a friend request. And I definitely keep you in a rotation. Um, I just saw your video about Wolverine. If they're unlikely to add him because of him being more of an X-Man than an Avenger, do you think that drops the chances of other teams like Fantastic Four and the Defenders? Um, like I said, with this game, they they operate under Marvel, so it's like they that was just one developer's opinion. So it's like no one can say definitively unless you know Marvel specifically tells them no, but. 
Um, I think anybody has a chance as long as they feel like it makes sense for their story. Um, guys, if we can skip. Um, hope we get Thordis tomorrow. Yeah, I, I'm down for Thordis. Uh, can we press skip, guys? Press circle a couple times. All right, Ethan, I got you. All right, um, hide behind these pillars. So hide in the shadows. So on this part, you want to get the echoes, these pink guys, you want to get them inside the circle and defeat them in the circle. So try to keep them in the circle once you get them in there and just defeat them once you get in there. Get in there, bro. Um, Kamala, you should be able to grab them, I think if you ain't bigging. one so we got to do it a couple more times all right guys hi make sure you got some cover Keep them in a circle. Oh, I got you. Oh, I got you. And don't sweat it if you go down. I get you back up. It's not a problem. Everybody goes down. Sometimes it may not even be your fault. You can get a, um, a glitch with your health and that makes it easier for you to go down despite your, you know, what your health actually is. So definitely don't, don't feel like you're doing bad or anything like that. And make sure you guys are hiding. Try to give you some cover. See how he looking. Um, help Kamala and uh, Ivy if you can get me up. I'll get both of you guys as soon as I'm up. Push him out, don't push him out. Try to try to let him come back in. Kamala, you wanna stop punching him outside the circle. They we gotta beat him in the circle, Kamala. In, inside the Alright, we on to the next phase. Uh, was it Jane without a cape? Possibly. Could it be a graphic glitch? Just give me Captain Marvel and I'm chilling. I feel you. I checked Twitter but didn't see any promotion. Maybe more Jane scans. Yeah, they didn't. They could do a promotion tomorrow. Um, guys, can we skip? 
top circle a few times. Alright, well that's it now. So now in this phase you want to go attack his eyes. Get some cover. I gotta try to save my heroics for the next phase. Like stuff like this is how you end up going down super easy. It kind of gets spammy with the damage. Okay, so for this phase, you got to beat the spiders inside, inside the circle. Seriously. That's what happens when you look away for a second. Uh, they also changed the animations for Thor's electricity, I notice. Right, let me try to get these chunks in. Try to keep them in the circle. Keep them in the circle. That's the only way we get through this phase is if you beat them in the circle. Alright, he's going down. We can get his eyes. Avengers! Alright, I suppose. Who we got subbing? Off the grid. Appreciate the sub off the grid. Appreciate the support. Guys, can we get to 200 likes on the stream? We got 181. Let's get to 200. Help push the video out even further. Um, so 
And we're gonna try to get Aaron in after this one. Uh, we might just do an OLT since that'll be a little quicker. And then we'll probably wrap up around 10. But definitely appreciate everybody coming through, hanging out. Uh, like I said, if you guys got questions about anything, like rumors or, you know, who's coming up next or, you know, you know any questions for me specifically, just drop them in the chat. All right. Um... Oh, you good, Jorge? Or like, like I said, there's no, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's just, it just helps the channel. You know what I'm saying? It's not a, a pressure thing. I got three of my friends waiting. Is it okay if you join us in OLT? Uh, if we can get out of here by then, yeah. Um, I don't know what's going on. But. So, white screen of death looks like. Yeah, we all it look like we all got the white screen, and um, we don't have the option to to restart. Well, that sucks. Um, all right, so like we gotta back out. Um, but appreciate you guys running with me. Um, if I stream tomorrow, I'll, I'll try to get you guys back in as the first group to do the raid. You know, just to get a completion for you. Uh, yeah, you hate to see it. But, yeah, that's part of the game at this point. Like I said, until they get more stability between PS3 and PS4, you know, that's that's kind of par for the course. All right, Ivy, appreciate you coming through. Appreciate you raiding with me. Um, Like I said, if you can make it tomorrow or the next time I stream, I'll have you in the first group of people uh, who I raid with to try to get you all the way through the raid so you can get some of that gear for, game, for Jane. But um, go ahead and get you some sleep. Appreciate you staying up this late with the stream. Uh, Aaron, you can you can send an invite. I'll hop in with you guys. Uh, Final Fantasy fan, <laughs> yeah, you peeped the theme. Yeah, Final Final Fantasy is dope. Uh, I like um, I like Cloud Strife. Yeah, I love his sword and everything. I'm not the biggest Final Fantasy fan, but you know, I, I dabble a little bit. All right, Aaron. Uh, once it comes through, I'll hop in with you. See me, um, hold on. I got you.
to get it. Nobody's running with Jane, I see. Okay. Ready up and go. Yeah, Jalen, um, like I said, bro, appreciate you coming through. Sorry we couldn't, you know, get all the way through the raid. But, like I said, if we, um, if I can find time to stream tomorrow, you'll definitely be in the first group that we run the raid with if you're around. See Kamala treating the exos like toys, palming them up. Can I hear? Uh, one side. Uh, nope, my headphones died. Well done. Keep going. Enemies. What's up, bro? One sec. Yeah, bro. Like I said, um, anytime, bro. Anytime anybody need to run something and I'm on stream, we can do it.
Did they fix the pre precise throw mastery? It's not working for me. Precise throw for who? For Thor? any problems with the precision are you talking about like with his arm um, and transit because they fixed that on my end but if, if it's still bugging out for you um you might want to pass that on on to the discord or to the official account on twitter See the bots up to their nonsense tonight. Thankfully, I got night bot now. So I don't have to focus on it. So chat, let me know who you think is coming first, Bucky or She-Hulk. Do you think they're going to um, stick with what makes sense and give us She-Hulk around the time of her show? Or are they going to switch it up and let Winter Soldier jump the line a little? Drop a one if you think Bucky's coming, and drop a two if you think Shitty Hawk is coming first. You see how easy it is playing with Thor, guys. Like, I, having a female Thor is not a bad thing. <laughs> having two Thors is definitely not a bad thing. We got a lot of She-Hulk love coming through. Maybe they're lying about updates taking longer and they can squeeze Bucky before She-Hulk. 
Yeah, I mean, I don't think they're lying. Like right now, they they're just not ready for um Cologne and Labs to drop. I feel like once they're you know ready and feel like they can you know squeeze it out in a certain time, they will and they'll communicate that. some time yeah we eight likes away from 200 likes if we can get 200 likes on the stream that would be an absolute W and he caught me right as I was getting time I'm more inclined to believe Bucky first even if Brian and Sam Miller is BS but I hope She-Hulk debuts not too far from her show. Um, yeah, like I said, I feel like they could be just pivoting, you know, trying to put some distance between She-Hulk and Jane just to, you know, avoid some, some of those narratives that may, you know, come about. All right, let's see it. Like I said, at this point, there's nothing concrete. Um, we don't know anything for sure. It's just a, a rumor being circulated. They should have buffed Spider-Man and Black Panther. I agree. I definitely agree. And I think they plan to do, you know, some tune-ups on some of the older heroes. They just, you know, have to find time and, you know, get team members dedicated to focusing on stuff like that. They're still building um, and expanding their team currently. So it'll be a while before, you know, we really see them at max capacity. You know, you got to hire, you got to um, get them onboarded, you know, and everything like that. Get them caught up on the processes and everything. Get them to a point where you're comfortable leaving them on task solo. So, once the new team catches up on everything, I feel like things will pick up a lot as far as, you know, development. Um, my only issue with the game is how with solo leveling up, they still want you to play multiplayer, which to me defeats the purpose. Yeah, I agree. Um, they, that's something they have to re rethink design-wise. That's a design flaw. But, you know, that's uh, sort of the beauty of being live service. They can, you know, fix stuff like that in the future. So it might take them time, but it's doable. the second one the second phase bro I'm heading out have a good night or a day cast <laughs> catch you keep averaging bro avenging I'm sorry y'all um, have a good night bro it's, it's nighttime over here too that's why I'm wrapping up after this this OLT but appreciate you coming through, Jorge, hey, bro. Really appreciate it. Um, and if you just got to the stream, we six likes away from 200 likes on the stream. If you can smash that like, that would be much appreciated. Um, not all events. Rescaya lets you get a full set completely solo. She Hulk comes in July and Winter Soldier in November. Ant Man in January, Captain Marvel in June, War Machine probably in September. I, I like that roadmap. I like it. I like it a lot. I wouldn't complain. Alright, this is the last phase. Yeah, like stuff, parts of missions like this is like I'm not really a fan of and I, I wish they would have found something else to include in this mission other than the war bot. Like I think, you know, I, I don't know any anything but the war bot in this part. 
hopefully they learned and don't include stuff like this in cloning labs I would rather just fight enemies and bosses I don't want to stand on platforms and stuff like that um, so far two events take multiplayer to completely finish which is a waste of time Marvel might be the best saga, at least the Infinity War saga. Uh, yeah, I love Infinity War. That's one of my favorite Marvel movies. That's definitely in my top three. Do you think War Machine's Ultimate would be him turning into turning part of his armor into a tank, like in the comics? Um, yeah, they. That's something they definitely would explore because they look at the movies and the comics for inspiration, for different hero attacks. this done and we're done GG's GG's guys appreciate you running with me but yeah bro anytime you see me online or you know you see me streaming feel free to you know send an invite or hop in you know I'm always down to run alright bro y'all have a good night Right, Chad that is a wrap nah. we are four likes away from 200 can we get 200 likes on the video before we wrap up that is the question if you haven't already slapped like on the stream to help YouTube push it further into the algorithm but um like I said we'll definitely be back either tomorrow or sometime later in the week um, like I said, if you need help running, you know, in-game content like the OLT or the raid, you know, I'm always down to help you guys with stuff like that. So don't don't hesitate. Don't worry about you know how you perform or anything like that. We'll get you through it, and you know, we'll get you that gear you're looking for. Um, appreciate you guys hanging out with me tonight. Um, appreciate you guys chilling, talking rumors with me. Let me know your thoughts and questions down in the comments. Helping to keep the conversation going, keeping me company for a little bit. Um, I, I cannot express how much I appreciate you guys, and I definitely look forward to you know dropping more videos, doing more streams, and hanging out with you guys more in the future. So, again, appreciate you guys. Everybody have a good night. You know, stay safe, and we will talk Avengers more tomorrow. So, catch you guys later.